constantly challenging to come up with new and exciting recipes that you can cook for your family. Kailangan kasi laging special. At kung kukuha ka man ng inspirasyon from cookbooks and websites, dapat hindi rin magmukhang copycat lang. That's why I always try to give my own little twist to the recipes I discover. I'm Jenilyn Mercado and join me as I give you your daily serving of dishes that bring your family closer together. Let's all experience Set Up With Family! Lately, I have been thinking of preparing something Japanese for my family. And sa paghahanap-hanap ko sa internet, I stumbled upon this teriyaki recipe. And sa pag-iisip ko ng paraan kung paano ito mabibigyan ng aking personal touch, I came up with an idea. What if i-combine ko ang burger and teriyaki in one recipe? And so, this is my version of teriyaki. CDO Ulam Burger Teriyaki Rice Bowl. For this recipe, we will be needing... 1 tablespoon oil, CDO ulam burger shaped into bite-sized balls, 3 cloves garlic minced, 1 thumb-sized ginger minced, 1 tea slip, 1 half cup soy sauce, 2 tablespoon mirin, 1 and a half tablespoon brown sugar, 1 fourth cup water, 1 half tablespoon cornstarch, 2 cups sauteed bean sprouts in garlic, 2 cups Japanese rice cooked, 2 teaspoon sesame oil, 1 tablespoon sesame seeds. Bago natin bilugin ang CDO ulam burger into balls, i-preheat ko muna itong pan. Ayan. Para mamaya, pag nag-fry tayo, mainit na mainit na. Maglalagay lang tayo ng konting oil sa ating kamay para hindi dumikit yung uh, ulam burger. Lagay natin, kukuha tayo na. shape natin ang bilog. Dali lang siyang gawin. Ayan! As you can see, napaka-flexible talaga nitong CDO ulam burger dahil pwede mo siyang gamitin sa kahit anong dish. At uh, pwede siyang alternative sa raw beef na nabibili natin sa supermarket. O, diba? Okay! Tagyan na natin ng oil yung pan. Tapos pwede na nating i-fry ang ating CDO ulam burger. Okay. Yan. Ako, ngayon na amoy ko beefy na beefy talaga yung amoy niya. Ayan. Pakadali lang nito lutuin. Hindi mo na kailangan ng mga seasonings at matipid pa sa gas kasi hindi ka na kailangan magpakulo pa ng beef, di ba? Tapos um, iisa-isahin mo pa, matipid sa oras, matipid sa gas and napakamura lang po nito. Okay. Antayin lang natin na maluto. By forming into meatballs, we can control the number of pieces we want. Depende kung gano'ng karami ang gusto mo. Diba? Luto na ang ating meatballs. Tatabi muna natin. Mmm! Grabe. Beef na beef yung aroma. Sobrang bango. Simula tayo ng sute. Nahin natin ang garlic. Ginger. Leeks. Alam niyo, maganda itong pambaon sa mga kids, no? Kesa yung sa mga fried lang yung mga niluluto niyo para pambaon nila. Para may iba namang lasa, ibang variations naman, di ba? Tsaka hindi nakakasawa. Napakadali lang itong i-prepare, kaya... Pwedeng-pwedeng pambaon ng mga kids sa school. Ayan, okay. Tapos susunod natin, lalagyan natin ng soy sauce. Ayan. 
sugar. And mirin. Yes. Tapos ilalagay na natin yung water. Corn starch. Para pampalapot. Pag medyo nag-thicken na yung sauce, pwede na natin ilagay yung meatballs, ang ating mga meatballs. sesame oil. Ang maganda rin dito sa CDO Ulam Burger, hindi na natin kailangan lagyan pa ng spices kasi kumpleto na siya, malasa na siya, beefy na beefy na siya. So, so hindi mo na siya kailangan lagyan pa ng mga salt, pepper, o kung ano-ano pa. Pink luto na. Pwede na natin kinagay sa plate. Siyempre, mas masarap kumain pag maganda yung plating, no? Maayos na maayos siya. Maganda, maganda siya tingnan. Okay. Tapos, lalagyan natin ng meatballs. Lalagyan na natin ng ating CDO kung lang burger. Tapos, lalagay na natin ang ating bean sprouts. etong bean sprouts ito, uh, sinote lang natin ito sa garlic. And that's it. Pwede mo siyang ilagay sa side. Ayan. Tapos, ang ating um, garnish. Ang leeks. Ito yung um, green part. At ang ating sesame seeds. Lagyan natin ng konting sauce. Ayan! Ready na ang ating CDO Ulam Burger Teriyaki Rice Bowl. Pero bago natin tikman, picturean muna natin. Ah, pwede na to. Okay, tikman na natin. Rice. Sarap ng meat. Sobrang beef na beef. I'm sure my family will love this quick and easy version of teriyaki that I came up with. CDO Ulam Burger is so meaty and well-seasoned, kaya nalalasahan mo talaga yung sarap ng beef. At mas lalo pa siyang na-highlight because of the teriyaki sauce. Bata man o matanda, alam nyo, magugustuhan nyo talaga itong dish na to. It's not only very easy to prepare, it's also affordable, kaya pasok sa budget ng mga mommies out there. If you want to try this CDO Ulam Burger Teriyaki Rice Bowl, it's very easy. Just pan fry the CDO Ulam Burger patties, then saute garlic, ginger, and leeks. Then add in soy sauce, water, mirin, and brown sugar. Add CDO Ulam Burger, then drizzle with sesame oil. Then put each serving on top of a rice bowl with sauteed bean sprouts and sprinkle with sesame seeds. That's one well-known dish made more interesting by adding a little personal touch. At syempre, ang wais na sikreto, CDO Ulam Burger. 
Till next time, join me again in making dishes extra special for the ones we love. I'm Jenilyn Mercado and this is Set Up With Family. Set Up With Family is brought to you by CDO Ulam Burger, CDO Idol Cheese Dog, CDO Fantastic Young Pork Sino. Set Up With Family would like to thank Gastro Chef.